you to his presence today and I want to salute those who are here yesterday for the evangelism. It was an awesome time. It was a great experience. It's an experience you will know, never forget. And the Lord will bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. We are still going to have another one. Those who couldn't make it, try to make it next time. God will create time for you as you create time for the Lord in Jesus' name. Amen. The book of Joel, chapter 2, I will be teaching today on the message titled Restoration. Somebody say, I will be restored. Will be restored. In Jesus' name. Amen. Joel, chapter 2. Verses 21 to 26. The Bible says, Fear not, O land. Be glad and rejoice. For the Lord will do great things. Talk to your neighbor and say, Neighbor, neighbor. this month, God will do great things in my life. Verse 22 Be not afraid, ye beasts of the feet. For the pastures of the wilderness do spread. For the tree beareth our fruit, and the fig tree and the vine do ye their strength. Verse 23 Be glad then, ye children of Zion, and rejoice in the Lord your God. For he has given you the former rain moderately. I will cause to come down for you the rain, the former rain. And the latter rain in the first month. Somebody says it's going to rain. Upon us will rain upon my land. And I will be fruitful in Jesus' name. Verse 24. And the floors shall be full of wheat. And the fire shall overflow with wine and oil. Verse 25. And I will restore to you the years that the locals had eaten. The cattle work and the caterpillar and the palmer work, my great army, which I sent among you. The last verse. And you shall eat in plenty and be satisfied. Amen. And praise the name of the Lord your God Amen. that has dealt wondrously with you. And my people shall never be ashamed. Amen. Amen. Somebody say, I will not be ashamed. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. The month of April is the month of restoration. And we have said that this month, the Almighty God will restore you in Jesus' name. Amen. When He restores you, you will be beautiful again. You will make your life beautiful again. You will make everything around you glorious again. Because His glory will rest upon your life. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Somebody say, I will be beautiful again. Be beautiful. My life will be beautiful again. So restoration is the promise of God for you. Restoration of life. Restoration of destiny, restoration of your family, restoration of your marriage, restoration of your businesses, restoration of your star. Your star will shine again in Jesus' name. Amen. To go a little bit deeper into this message, we want to know what is it that we are talking about. What is restoration? What, is, what does it mean for someone to be restored, for something to be restored? What does it really mean? But number one, restoration means to bring something or someone back to his former position or condition or status. You cause somebody to be back again to what he used to be. Something was displaced. One way or the other, it was displaced. One way or the other, the degree has diminished. But you want to bring it back again. Whether you used to be on the mountain top before, suddenly you find yourself in the valley. And you don't have to stay there for a long time. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Somebody say, Valley is not for me. I will get to my mountain top. In Jesus' name. God does not want you to remain in the valley forever. You may be there for a while, but we visit you and bring you forth again. There were dry bones that were in the valley, in the open valley. God visited dry bones in the book of Ezekiel 37. That God who raised up dry bones will raise you up again in Jesus' name. Amen. There are five words I want to share with you that represent restoration. Point number one is this. Restoration means restatement. There are five R. 
The first R is reinstatement. You are reinstated back to what you used to be. You are reinstated back to your former position, your former status, your former condition. Now a better condition. But number two, restoration means restitution. That means you are giving back. What was taken from you was given back to you. You are refunded. Anybody waiting for a refund? Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> this month you will be refunded. Amen. Everything the enemy has stolen from you, you will return in Jesus' name.